we often live inside this mental box and we focus on the negative outcome of things. For example, every time a challenge occur, we get frustrated. And some of us may think that we don't deserve that. Or oh, no, not again. It's happening again. I've been through this so many times. What is this happening to me again? But I realized that challenges are often a blessing. One, because if we never get challenged from life, how do we grow? How do we expand? How do we learn? So a challenge is an opportunity to learn more, to understand more deeply, more profoundly. It's an, let's, let's put it this way, it's like a, a door towards infinite possibilities. But often because we focus only on what we already know or what belongs to the past or the outcome we have already experienced, we can't see new ways to deal perhaps with the same situation. And so my work helps create these pathways, helps create these bridges within the brain so you can connect the dots and find new ways to uh, deal with the challenge. And when you find new ways, something clicks inside and it's like, oh, I didn't know I had this uh, gifts within me. I didn't know I had these tools available. I didn't know I, you know, I, I could do this in this other way. And so you start activating also the creator within and your higher mind starts working. And so this is why we get out from the ordinary mind, the things you already know, the things you already done or try, and we activate the higher mind the superior mind. So you can feel, but from a different level. You can see, but from a different perspective. You can make decision, but not based on your emotional state. And for emotional state, I mean the lower vibrational state. But you can make decision from your heart perspective. What's right for me, which is not going against anybody, but going in favor of yourself. I'm doing this because it's healthy for me. And when you make a decision that is based on self-respect, everything around adjusts to it. It's just a natural consequence because the change is born from a pure feeling of understanding and accepting and loving and caring for yourself. And it doesn't have an intention of hurting anybody or upset anybody. If that happens, is you know, maybe the persons around you they have to do some work around that feeling. But if your decision comes from a pure place of understanding and awareness, there's an alignment. And then you can see the bigger picture. You can see all these streams and all these possibilities and all these pathways opening and expanding in your life. And the same thing applies to every field of our life.